This weekend, the shores of Charlie Lake were decorated with indigenous art as Beaton Provincial Park played host to the historic Kema experience. Kema experience was part of the uh, reconciliation of visibility of the local indigenous beaver people at Doig River and uh, the old Fortune Don Indian Band. Gary Oker is a member of Doig River First Nation community. Together with Lisa Hardy, who oversees Beaton Park, he made it possible for anyone to get a glimpse at the cultures and traditions of indigenous groups with a history in the region. I invited Gary out one day and I just wanted to hear about his vision and about how, you know, what reconciliation meant to him and, and how we could support that. And so we sat at the picnic table a couple years ago and Gary walked me through some trails and, and gave me some of the history. So from there, um, that always stuck in my mind. I have great happiness. <laughs> yeah. Just to, just to have a vision and an idea and then talking to a few people and everybody, yeah, that's a good idea, and then, and then start building it and just start putting the pieces and then well, it comes together and it, now it is. It's here and people are enjoying it, walking around. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty happy. Kema means a pure place in nature in beaver language. It's about getting rooted and energized through experience. We are still connected to our ancestors. You know, that we are still here, we still honor them. Um, I think I want people to be energized and say, wow, that's cool, you know, I want to learn more. After a weekend here at Beaton Provincial Park, the Kmog Experience will head south to Swan Lake Provincial Park the weekend of August 9th. Travis Fortnum, CJDC-TV News, Charlie Lake.